This is a painting I'm working on at the moment. I want to create this wonderful sort of nebula up here in the space. In space, um, I could crash and burn here. I'm I'm slightly uncharted territory. I know what I want to happen. I'm pretty sure it's going to happen. There's one way to find out. Either way, hopefully you'll learn. Either it'll work or it won't. <laughs> what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to dampen the canvas because I want my paint to move around a little bit and I don't want it to dry straight away and I also want some soft edges. You can see that that canvas has now gone white or paler anyway where I've put the put the water. And that will all eventually dry back and be the same color. But I want the canvas to be quite damp. Okay. Now, I'm going to pinch a little bit of colour. I want some really nice kind of um, sort of space kind of effects. So I'm going to do this right here, like that. It's probably a little bit too strong. And because I've wet the canvas, I can pull some of that up without too much trouble. Okay, now I'm going to just pinch a bit of red. I have no idea if this is going to work or not. <laughs> okay, we'll put a bit of yellow in there as well. Oops. Okay, so now I'm just going to spread all of that around so it's a little bit soft and indistinct. And this is the part where I hope it all worked. I get some water. This is a marbling technique. This is something, a technique that you use when you're creating marble. Gotta let that water or that paint dry a little bit. When it's dry to a certain extent, flick some water over it. And hopefully that'll all pull up strategically. Not there obviously. Not a bad idea when you do this to look at it from the side because you'll see where you've put your paint and where you haven't by the gloss level. Now I'm going to come back with my rag and pull up some of that paint. 